Hello, welcome back to Let's Play Black Book. And the dusty roads winds along the Colva. It's getting dark. You keep the Black Book ready. Khaldun's often put their chorts by the roads, as you have already witnessed several times. Soon, you notice someone's burning eyes under the roots of an old fir tree. Prepare to fight. Oh, they don't have much. Okay. Nope. Nope. Sorry. Nope. Same thing. How do you like my new fur? Don't trust you. Have. How can they possibly harm me? Kind of my yeah, I, so what I did was I forgot to note yeah, if you, if you wouldn't have which ally I wanted. And, you know, that's how I ended up with uh, flying with the skull in a bag instead of. The way? Yeah, I under you. I have no right. The main. I can't. It's you. <laughs> well, that. Instead of uh, All right, they cat what they wind do. god. In Fukcha, where my mother lives. The Every not everything is by the book. What are they Some see? They're brewing the beer. All right. Well, do you so? How's the pro? Soon, I think we can. Okay. Here's Alexander. Greetings. God. Grandpa and the met. Hello. I mean, you remember? There's a that's one. So thank you. Hold up. Table. Alexander. Okay. Now, proper. Ye. Oh my God. Yes. Okay. So much. And we are not it's immune to ward anymore. You keep the black book ready. Okay. <laughs> oh, I have a flying cat! Oh my god, I have a flying cat. Do that. Do that. Do that. Pop. Well, you know what? This will be interesting. Oh. Watch you bounce. Bounce. Okay. They're just going to die. Seriously. Oh no, it only does one damage right now, that's right. Uh-huh. Oh, you got rid of my, um... You got rid of my ward. Oh, I need to put in that ability, that... Positive status, positive status. So my piety is going to go away. Oh, 
Oh, because you got rid of my ability to do damage whenever I gain shields. I see. My burning blood is still there. Well, there went my burning blood, but it doesn't matter. Well-versed ward. Take two pages immediately. Oh my goodness. So what this will do is it happens immediately, which means it doesn't go to the spell. And you choose a page and add you can add damage to it, but this power goes away forever. I like draw. Draw is fine. Oh, I should have gotten the one that was the ward though, to be honest. Among the treetops, you notice a silent giant. His figure towers over the trees and sheds a dark shadow on the frozen road. I'm using waste. I should use that. Huh. You greet the choit, but hear only loud laughter in reply. A sudden... Hmm. Sudden wind. Sorry, I cut it off at the end there. You find the Izba Alexander told you about without any difficulties, and question the locals. As it turns out, the husband of the sick woman died recently. Your acquaintance is already here. Hmm. Fish traps. Likely she goes, or she herself goes uh, fishing. As well as the rest of the Izba has fallen into disrepair, it's clear that the woman can't look after the house alone. Some images are overturned, looks like the work of a demon. Let me be. I need to rest. The fever won't let me be. I need to search the Izba to know what's going on here. They say you became a widow. Oh, Jesus Christ, may he rest in peace. Yes, he died. I'm managing. Sometimes dead husbands come back from the afterlife. Have you heard of that? What kind of s story is that? That sort of thing never happens. Lord have mercy. Don't try to be cunning with me. I've seen all kinds of charts, and I can sense the walking dead from a mile away. <laughs> Which? What could you know about me and my Vasya? You know nothing. Maybe I'll be able to convince her if I pretend to be her acquaintance. So, what did her husband do? Fisherman. Perhaps he was a fisherman. Looks like it. There are fish traps in the corner. What do you mean? I know you through my godfather. He used to go fishing with Yavasili quite often. He won't be fishing any now. He's dead, I tell you. Go away. You and your broom, let me rest. Mm. She still doesn't believe me. How can I convince her that everything's not so simple with her guest? Oh, no. Okay, I went... I went that too early. Um, so I'm going to reload. Don't talk to her right away. You find the Izba Alexander told you about with that. Okay. About talking to you. Vasily, sir. Alexander coughs Oops. and glances at your book. Did you examine the sick woman? Yes. The case is indeed similar to that in the Logova village. The woman is weak, but it's not so bad as that time. It's still early. The demon only started coming to her. What is she saying about the chort? There was no mention of chorts. You think they're to blame? She says it's a simple fever. But the symptoms are rather strange. I thought it to be anemia and nervousness. She buried her husband not long ago. It seems strange because it's not a simple sickness. She can't tell because the demon has some power over her. What should we do? The snake doesn't appear often in the beginning. We'll have to make it. Some charts take the image of a dead relative off of the husband and come to the grieving... Such tort flies in the sky as a fire sheaf broom or spindle only on the ground. It assumes 
the dead man's image, one can recognize the demon by the absence if of the spine. If she tells me about it, it will surely come. It's Slade. It will try to kill us. Uh, right? I won't stand in your way. Okay. Chest. We opened the chest and are hit with a foul stench. Inside lie everyday items of the woman and several linen sacks. It seems they are the source of the smell. You wince in disgust. The sacks contain horse manure, wriggling with worms. These are the gifts of a demon. To cursed people, they seem like gold and prianix. Bed sheets and towels, nothing of interest. Mm -hmm. Lots of red there. See, yeah, that's the thing I missed. I went too early. And then, of course, that. Any other spots? Can get all the way back over here. Doesn't look like it. Let me be. I need to rest. The fever will... They say you became a widow. Yes. Sometimes dead husband. What kind of... Don't try to be true. Which... Maybe I'll be able to convince her. Perhaps he was a fisherman. What do you mean? He won't be fishing. Mm. She still doesn't believe me. How can I convince her that everything is not so simple with her guest? The chest. Have a large chest. Did George bring it? What a silly... I know who is to blame for your sickness. What? If you want to live, you must tell me. What? Ah, oh, that's stupid. Okay, yes, I'm reloading. You find the Izba Alexander told you about without... Vasilisa. Alexander. You... Yeah, the woman is... It's still... She said... There was... But the sin... Seems... What should we do? The snake doesn't... If she tells... Uh, right. You open the chest and are hit with bed sheets and towels. You wince in disgust. You wince in disgust. Mm -hmm. How did I get back there? Oh. Hand fingers transposed. Oh, there's in the a corner of the Izba stands a solid Russian stove. On the whitewashed mouth, you can see black traces of soot. It's difficult to say who is to blame a demon or a housewife's clumsiness. The stove is of central importance in Chiard and is used in daily, daily to cook and to make baked bread, baked milk, and sour cream. It's also used to dry berries and mushrooms for winter. When the most modern oven and electric stoves cannot compete with genuine Russian stove, it prov even oh, even the most modern okay provide light, warmth, a place to sleep, and dry boots and clothes. In Russian North, the fireplace stoves were prevalent, built of stone with, without, without mortar. In Northern Prikmaya, brick or clay stoves were common. For some reason, the stoves were stoked the black way, meaning they had no chimney, and the smoke escaped through a special window or crack near the ceiling. In old Ladoga stove foundations were up to 1.5 meters across. The Russian stove is a complex construction consisting of 25 elements. Children are taught how to stoke it from an early age. Stove bench is a wooden bench for lying down and sleeping. It is built between the stove and the wall, close to the ceiling. The stove was not usually stoked after midnight. It was considered impossible because of the bad backdraft it produced at night. White wash mouth, black truce, traces of suit. You talked to not yet, but soon. Right. Mm hmm. And icon. And I could save here, but it would just save me at the start of this. Loading it would just take me to the start of this. Let me be. I need to rest. The fever won't let me be. They say you became yes. sometimes. What? Don't try to. Maybe I'll be able to convince her. Perhaps he was a fisherman. What do you mean? I he won't be fishing. Mm. She still doesn't believe me. How can I convince it's her that everything the is the icon? So with her? Look, you even have an eye. What to see? I know who is to blame. All oh, right. My husband didn't die. You hear the sound of scattering sparks. What did I get wrong? Familiar to you, oh. the stove, and it immediately 
turns into a human. It's not the chest, it's the things inside the chest. It's the gifts. Ah, oh, context. You find the I was on the right told you about without I was on the right track. I was on the right thing from the very start, just not understanding what Alexander, do you examine this? Yes. What the Woman game wanted me. What game wanted me more specific? What should be snake? She okay. Yep. In the corner of the Isba. Uh huh. You open the chest and are you wince in disgust. Bed sheets and towels. Can I get back here to look at the icon? I cannot. Let me be. I need to rest. They say you okay. Be yes. Sometimes that. What kind of? Don't try to be cunning. Which? Maybe I'll be able to convince. Perhaps he was officially me. So what threw me off me. is the ch chest, but the chest has things in there that don't so mean that. anything. The bed sheets and daily items. The gifts is what we want to talk about. You think your Vasily brings you sweets? Take a closer look. Jesus, what have you done, witch? I know who is to blame for your sickness. If you want to live, you must tell me. All right, I'll tell you, but don't you tell anyone. My husband didn't die. He still visits me in the evenings, but he told me to keep quiet. People won't understand. You hear the sound of scattering sparks. A fire short, familiar to you, emerges from the stove, and it immediately turns into a human. Again with your blood switch. Don't interfere with my business. You want to kill me? Didn't work out for you last time. Ha! Kill? <laughs> I have another purpose. You stop me here, but I'll find other creatures. Not so fast. You can't hide from me in my yes. But maybe so. That's why you will be with my new friends. I won't be back here. A couple of shorts appear near him while he himself turns into a fiery whirlwind and disappears into the chimney. We can't leave this girl alone, Vasya. You can catch up with that short if you don't spend time on these demons. But what will happen to the sick woman? We'll stay. You open we'll catch up with him later. The first Zagavar. Okay. You're all just attacking me. Cool. Keeping my shields on forever, or nine rounds anyway. Mm -hmm. Awesome. I have a flying kitty. Mm -hmm. Hmm. Did my ward go away? It did. Mm-hmm. 
<laughs> do 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 damage to everybody whenever I gain protection. Yep. You're actually dead. And we're going to make it worse. Well-versed waste. We're going to get well-versed ward this time. You defeated the choice, and the woman seems to be safe now. But how many souls will this fiery snake ruin? No one knows the answer to this question. You can only continue on your way. And I'm going to go to one more video. See you in a little bit.